Reading keyboard input. In this presentation, we're going to look at reading strings and char. The scanner class contains a method to read a string from data. The method is called next line. In this example, we see that um, after declaring a, key, a scanner object named keyboard, you're going to read in a, um, a string and store it in a string uh, um, title. So title equals keyboard.nextLine. That's an example of how to use the next line method. Let's write a complete program though. We want, to, we want to prompt the user, please enter your first name. And we'll read in the first name. Then we'll say, please read in your, enter your last name. And we'll read the last name. And then we will display the first initials. In this instance, Zoe and Rambo, initials are Zo Z um, and R. Okay, let's create a new program. First, I need to import java.util.scanner public class my um, initials public static void main string arcs I'm going to declare two string um, variables, uh, reference variables, string first, comma, last. And I'm going to create a scanner object, scanner, kb equals new scanner, system.in. I will prompt the user to enter in the first um, name and then the last name, system.out.print. Enter your first name. I'm going to read it in. First equals kb.nextLine. Then system.out.print. Enter your last name. And last equals kb.nextLine. And I will just display their initials. To display the initials, the first the initials of the first character in each string. So system that out dot print line your initials are plus first dot char at zero. Remember the char at method in scanner gives you the first character. Um, it gives you the character, uh, and we're specifying the position 0. The first character is at position 0 of my string, plus, a little like a little period, plus last dot char at 0, plus a little period after that. Close off my main, close off my class, and now let's compile. and then run. Enter your first name, I'm going to type in Zoe, and last name, Rambo. Your initials are Z dot R. Sometimes you may want to read a single character from the keyboard. For instance, you may say enter your first initial. They type in the character Z, and then we say your first initial is Z. The scanner class, however, does not have a method for reading a, a single character. You've got to read in uh, first a string. So use next line to read in the string, and then you got to use the char at method to extract the first character from the string. So whenever you want to deal with a, um, a string, uh, excuse me, read a single character, you've got to read in a string first, then use the char at method to extract the first letter from the string.
Okay, let's write a new program. I right, import java.util.scanner public class my first initial public static void name string args um, string response I have to have a string and I'm also going to create a char um, initial I need a scanner object scanner um, KB equals new scanner System dot in system out dot print enter your first initial and then um, I have to read it in as a string response equals kb dot next line the scanner class um, does uh, has a method to read in one string next line and then I've got to extract the first character initial equals kb dot, excuse me equals response dot char at and get the first position um, at position zero and then I can display it so initial system dot out dot print um, your first initial is and then system dot out dot print initial close off my main close off my class compile my program compile save and then um, comp I think I need to compile it and then run it enter your first initial and I'll enter in um, T your first initial is T